Did Cincinnati City Manager Harry Black abuse power or simply legitimately exercise it under the city's charter? That's at the heart of a federal lawsuit filed by veteran fire district chief Rafael Prophet. In the suit, he alleges being wrongfully passed over for promotion because Black considered him a troublemaker. It's the second such lawsuit against Black. The other is from a veteran police commander. The allegations, and that's all they are, is allegations, are very troubling. City lawmakers say the whole can of worms should play out in the courts. Rank and file leaders were on hand as a time frame requiring infinite patience was laid out. The city will be filing its response in the ordinary course. Please be reminded that a typical federal lawsuit takes anywhere from two to four years to complete. The firefighters union is not party to the litigation, which asserts Profit was the most qualified applicant for promotion. Local 48's president points out the method for promotion changed about a generation ago. 2001, issue five was passed by the voters, which allows the city manager basically free reign to appoint at his discretion, the assistant chief. Prophet alleges Black is retaliating against him for reporting misconduct to his superiors. Without making a judgment about that, counsel emphasized this message. It is incredibly important that all city employees know that we want them to bring information to their uh, director or their police chief or the city manager. Now, both lawsuits come in the midst of a highly competitive Maryland Council campaign. Fire Union President Matt Alter today expressing the hope that this not be politicized and left to the courts to straighten out. Mike.